I know they hating on me, cause I'm the man. I'm too tree and homie, I don't give a damn. I'm a self made, tree now. I'm a self made, tree now. From the underground to the top, I came from the bottom. Rod with True Boxing is here with the Corpus Christi kid. Uh, just getting ready for his fight, man. Looking sharp, man. August 7th, Fox 1, Aleha Bata, uh, Golden Boy Promotion, the Ameri American Bank Center here in your hometown, man. How you feeling? I'm feeling great, man. Just got done doing a hard 10, uh, 10 rounds of work. Put in the work and be ready. All right, and how's training camp been so far in this hot summer, man? It's real humid down here. Oh, it's real good. The, the pounds are coming off uh, easy. You can tell by the way inside how the, the heat is in the gym. But um, we're going good. Uh, everything's right where we want it to be. All right, and your last fight, man, is it kind of hard to shake off the, the last loss? Because a lot of people think that you should be the WBC champion right now. Yeah, I mean, I honestly feel like I am the WBC champion. Uh, even though I don't have a belt with me, but um, I feel that I won the fight. I feel that if I get a rematch, I will dominate the fight. And I hope I get the fight after this fight. All right, and we saw like a similar situation with Canelo Laura, where you know Laura was going up for Canelo's name and belt. Uh, do you feel like you know as as the challenger going up for the, for those belts that you have to do a little more than uh, you know than than normal? Um, kind of. I mean, with the difference between me and Laura, Laura was um, running around the ring and not really throwing. Mm -hmm. Me, I was throwing my jab, and he was coming out throw a right hand. Every uh, I pop shot him. And um, that's the difference between him. I'll run him and hit, and he'll just run. That seems to reward you with the showcase fight, and they kind of have him back on the undercard. Uh, do you kind of see that as as kind of a because uh, 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 well, of what happened that last time in Carson, California? Yeah, I think they're giving me a gift to fight here in my hometown as a main event on uh, national TV. So um, I, I know that Golden Boy seen what what would happen, and they knew that the judges really messed me up. But um, what can we do? Just keep going forward and hope we get a rematch. Yeah, it's one of those unfortunate situations in boxing, man. Uh, and then as far as Abner Cota, man, what do you see him bringing to the fight? Uh, I see him bringing just the way he is. I don't think he can switch any, uh, anything up. He's just a one-dimensional fighter. He fights straight up, no head movement, um, pretty, pretty slow, and um, wide open for a lot of punches, and we're going to take full advantage of it. All right, and you're still young. You had a couple of setbacks, but you kind of had a resurgence lately. Uh, what do you credit to this new spark in your career? Oh, my kids, man. My kids, uh, really, and my dad and my brother, my older brother, um, he's in my, my corner. He's been in my corner since uh, my Will Thomason fight, and he just pushes me to the limit, uh, motivates me. He's not here right now because he's at work, but um, when, when, he, when he is here, I mean, we, we really push. We really push, and he gives me that extra edge to, to really take it, take it up a little notch. Uh, what can we expect out of out of Corpus Christi Kid August seventh, man? Expect good head move, head movement, uh, footwork, a lot of combinations, and you're gonna see a, a either a TKO or a KO, I guarantee it. Definitely, definitely, man. Uh, excited about that. Um, any last words and shout outs you want to give out before you let you go, bro? Nah, just a shout out to my team. We're working really hard. We're ready. And Amir Koto, get ready because we we coming for you. Yeah, definitely. Shout out to you, your team, uh, your manager, Adrian Clark, good guy. Um, Leha Bata, promotions, and Golden Boy, man. So, uh, looking forward to it, man. You look sharp, and we'll definitely be in the house catching up with you, man. Uh, Raw True Boxing, signing out.